Hi Twin Flames and welcome to the Twin Flame Energy Forecast for the following week. Let's see what's up with your Twin Flame, what's up with you, and our final card as always is next steps that you can take in order to expedite your Harmonious Twin Flame Union. So let's get started with the card for your Twin Flame. Let's see how they're going to be affected this week, what to expect from them. And we have reaching your destination. So I get the feeling that there is something that your twin flame had been aspiring to, praying for, wishing for, that is coming to fruition this week. And I feel like this is a goal that affects you. Maybe that was them wanting to reach out to you, but not finding the strength or the courage to do so because there had to be a difficult conversation. Or maybe it was to confess their feelings to you or whatever it was, it definitely had to do with the Twin Flame journey and with a way to advance your relationship. However, for most of you, I can also feel that it was a difficult decision and it was something that they were building up to for quite some time now. So it wasn't a spur of the moment thing and it wasn't something easy. And I'm saying this so that you are aware that your Twin Flame is also taking the steps to meet you halfway, to manifest your harmonious union together. And those steps aren't always easy. I see a lot of twin flames who are aware of the twin flame journey and they see their twin flame's life from the outside perspective. And they're like, oh, they've got this thing going on. Like, let's say they have financial abundance. They're doing great at their job. They are dating other people, it seems that they're happy. Why are they happy and I'm suffering? But the thing is, you can't tell just by looking on the outside. But when you're really grounded in divine truth, you know that all those things aren't what's making someone happy. So your twin flame is also going through their own trials, their own lessons, and some of those, if not most of those, you won't be able to see because you'll only be able to see your own. And really, there's no point in you seeing their lessons and their trials, because why would you want to take on more? Taking on yours is more than enough. You don't have to lift the weight for both of you. So it's okay to surrender your Twin Flames lessons to them, and just take care of your own. You have enough on your plate as is. Don't make it harder on yourself. Next up, let's see what's up with you. What will the coming week bring you? In the flow, everything is smooth sailing. So if you've been struggling, if there had been interruptions, spiritual blocks, generally things being all over the place and you hating it, uh, this is coming to an end this week. You're going to notice that there is a divine flow to everything. And it's important that you release control about how you believe life should unfold and just relax and enjoy. The Twin Flame journey is a dance between you and the Divine. It's a healing journey. It's not about ticking the right boxes or your life looking as polished and perfect as possible or about just achieving the next goal. This is a very materialistic way of doing life and that's what the Twin Flame journey is calling for you to leave behind. Of course, you can have goals and standards, but it's also important to surrender. If it seems like something that you wanted to happen isn't happening on your time, it doesn't mean that you failed or that something is wrong. It means that there is a divine plan for that. And it's safe to trust that divine plan. And when something is taken out of your life, it means that it's about to be replaced with something that is aligned with you and even better for you. So it's also safe to trust that and receive everything the divine is giving to you. Don't cling to an idea about how things should look like. Focus on being present with yourself and your relationship with the divine and just enjoy every moment, no matter what's going on. Last but not least, let's see next steps. What is it that you can do to speed up your harmonious twin flame union? 
and we have the Gate of Triumph. So this week you're called to redefine what success means to you. The world has given us a certain definition of what a successful person looks like, acts like, what their day looks like, all of that. But does that align with you? What about your goals? Perhaps for you, success is living in a nice cabin in the woods, enjoying the peace, having a family. And there's nothing wrong with that. Not everyone's definition of success is the same. And it's important that once you find what this definition of success is for you, that you can start working towards it in whatever way you can right now. You don't have to wait for your twin flame to start building your life. If anything, building your dream life is what's going to attract your twin flame to you. And that's a very powerful manifestation tool to bring them into your life if you're in separation. If you're not in separation and you're looking to take your union to the next level, then get clear on your goals together. What do you want your life to look like? You can be as detailed as you want with this. And you can start working on those changes together. And that's going to bring you even closer together. This also involves discovering what your purpose is as a twin flame union and as an individual. How do you want to help the planet heal? What are your gifts? What are you good at? What do you enjoy doing? And it might be a few multiple things. So you don't have to limit yourself to just one or two things. You're a divine being, so there's many sides of you. So I feel like this week will be a great week for self-discovery and also healing any worthiness upsets. Like if you've been feeling not so worthy of success and like you're not good enough, you're not there yet, you're not healed enough, it's time to let those beliefs go because you deserve success in every area of your life and it's possible for you. You're on the journey to do exactly that. So this is all I had for you this week, my dear Twin Flames. Thank you so much for watching this video and I hope to see you in the next one.